In this session, let's learn how to transform the row values into column values using the list tag analytical function. The advantage of list tag analytical function is you can group all the values and all the values can be displayed in a single column. Okay, you see here for south, I have two customers and now I'm transforming that row into column level data, but into a single column. You see for south, we have Amrit Raj, Kama, Joseph. You see, these are the two customers, right? So we have combined those two values into a single column. Okay, like this, whenever you have multiple rows of values and you want to display those values in a single column separated by comma or semicolon or colon or any other separator, you have to use the list tag analytical function. Okay, you see how simple it is. Select and the column which you need and list tag and what are the values you need? You want the last name to be displayed separated by comma here. You can mention whatever separation operator you want. Okay. And this one you want to say within the group, right? So you have to say within the group, which group you already mentioned here region. So within the group region display all the last names separated by comma. And when you are displaying the values order by last name. That's all. You are just mentioning list all the values from the column list name separated by comma within the group region and order the values by last name. That's it. So now let's go and check it out. So let's go to the customer table. Okay. And these are all the columns we have. So we have two customers for south and one customer for north. So first let's select the columns we need. We need region, last name from customer. Okay. So now let's run this. Okay. We have two customers for region south and we have one customer for region north. So now let me display the values in single column. So I will say list ag bracket and then I'll separate it by comma. So I'll specify it in single quotations. I want these names to be separated within the group. So within group and I want it to be ordered by order by last name. And I'll call this as customer names. And here let me perform the group by. So now let me run this. That's it. You see for north we have one customer called man and for south we have two customers Amrit Raj and Joseph. See both those names are separated by comma. Okay. Like this you can take the row values and display those values in a single column separated by comma or colon or any other separation value. Okay.